Welcome, my children. This is a vacuum map, inspired by map number 1704. It's not really a hard map, but the start should be a little bit long, but the final should be satisfying. Pow! So this is Crib World, everybody. Um, we are playing a map where my cursor is a vacuum. Um, if I right-click, then I will beam up some creep. And if I right-click again, I beam it back down. Uh... We have very little creep at the moment, but we will get more. God, I hope. Can we kill you off? Nice. Okay, great. I need that mortar to kind of disappear. All right, can we just harass the mortar until it is it is gone? Because it is currently just shooting my boys. I need to do this slower. Uh, beaming up, beaming down. Slow and steady wins the race. There we go. Okay, right. I'm no longer being shot by a, a super guy. So we've got to kind of get out of there. They are making AC, which is not super good. Can we snipe these guys out? Like, if I can try and get that other emitter. Beam so up and beam it down. There we go. Okay, right now. 200 creep every 0.5 seconds. Okay, if I can take some creep. Where are you getting supplies from? Is there a world where we can actually just cut this off? Uh, the answer is a real maybe. But it's looking okay. Because they can't rebuild. They do not have that technology. So I just need to try and take out a few things where I can. Okay, feeling good. Okay, right, that is cut off. All right, where else are you actually connected? One more down. Very nice. Because if all of these guys stop firing that ammo, then hopefully this will spread out a little bit more. And I will be able to blast them pretty good. Uh, the super mortar is a bit of a problem over here. Okay, but we're getting a, a lot more creep now. I think as there's more creep on the map, we can vacuum up a lot more of it. Because now I can take 120 creep in one one click. Okay, we are getting very close. But that John Rambo gun is a bit of a nightmare for me. It's just like cutting off its ammo supply is definitely better than... Well, I guess we could just try and brute force kill it. Right. They'll run out of ammo. Let's just try and kill this off as well. Just to stop the super mortar having its way. Great. Okay, that should all take over. Right, the volcano... ...is looking fine. Do you want to kill off an M-Rift? Like, that's generally never a bad... ...a bad thing to do. Anything that, like, slows down their production lines is always good in my books. Okay. Right. Let's get some spores. I don't think freeing up those spores is really going to be doing a lot for me anytime soon. Unless it makes eggs. If it makes eggs, then we're, we're great. But I think the spores themselves are not going to actually do anything. 20? Well, okay. Maybe they will do something. Oh, they do make eggs. Okay, love that. What else do we have? There's another emitter. So the closer I get to their base, the less stuff I put out. Uh, the worse my return is. Like in this back corner, I get... 118% of what I put in. But if I come up here, just too too close to Rift Lab. Okay. Uh, where do I need to snipe? Are there any good areas for me? Like, we can just try and kill off the back lines. Okay. Whole load of spores coming. Love that. Right, the back edge, they won't shoot at me. Very good. Okay, where are we attacking next? Can we take that out? The answer is 
Yes. Nice. Okay. More real estate for me. Okay, we should probably just choose a point on the map and just chop, but... Can we free up another emitter? Just the more creep that's coming out, the better. Okay, one more. It wasn't one more. Two more. There we go. Okay, we've got another another big boy. A big strong boy on my front lines. Right, can we get these guns to not fire anymore? Great. And right, where do we want to attack next? Hmm. Oh, blobs. Blob sound. Very nice. Okay, a little little more. Beam me up. There we go. Eight blobs, sure. Like these guys don't have any or they don't have a lot of direct gun support, I say, as just all the mortars in the world open fire on me. Uh, just want to try and carve a path across the map so I can get get some of their supplies deactivated very good okay kill that off and we have almost carved ourselves a pretty legit path Okay, how are you still connected? It's not through here. Oh, it's over there. Okay, sure. Oh, don't beam down yet. I guess we could be trying to snipe out their missile launchers as well. Might make sense. Okay, wow, we're actually picking up a lot of creep now. Nice. Okay, great. A whole big section of the map has been turned off. I guess it isn't impossible for us just to free up a little bit more over here. Let's turn off a few more guns, and there we go. Right. How are you doing? Can we save you? Okay. I like just trying to drawing lines. And... We're good. Nice. Okay, it's a long way to go to really slice these bits up. But, slow and steady wins the race. Okay, my spores, my lovely spores are doing some good work. Wow. Okay, that was actually easier than expected. How are the blobs doing? Like, if we just blow up some stuff, that's always going to be good. Right, where are we heading next? Where do I want to be? I want to shut that whole thing thing down. God, look at all that good, good creep coming out. Right, there's nowhere that we're really generating more from. Air sacs? Oh my god, my boys. My sweet air sac children. I'll save you. Uh, wait, did we get skinners from somewhere? How did that stuff get stunned? Okay, six air sacs in four and a half minutes. I don't think they're going to be winning the day for us quite so much. Uh, sure, let's just kind of just shoot some of the mountains. Okay, this area... Feels fairly easy to slice up. Right, where do you get your supplies from? Oh, that back corner. Oh, that's easy enough. We'll just cut it off early. And... Kaboom! Nice! Right, we need to try and... Get that under my control. How much creep can we get in there? Well, those planes are going to be an absolute problem for me. We could just go and attack the airfields. Right, okay. We've kind of got a bit of stuff going on in there. Uh, right. Airfields. 
Nice and easy. <laughs> Great. Uh, once the runways go down... Great, the runways are out. Uh, we no longer have an air problem. And... Just keep throwing down. Creep. And trying to sever a few more of these connections. Ah, oh, it's really satisfying to use. They were not lying. Right. That all looks like... Something that can be blown up. Where are your supplies? They come in here. Nice. A whole new bit taken out. Do I need those super mortars to leave, ideally? Because then we can get this bad boy sort of going for it. If we feed the stash ourselves, it's like a baby bird. There we go. How are these still holding out? Do they just always have ammo? Uh, right. Let's go through there for a bit of fun. And just try and chop off that area. Nice. Okay, they do not have a ton of stuff left. And their generation going down pretty fast. Air sacs. Wait a second. God, can we have just... Oh, wait. How close can we even get to the Rift Lab? Oh, not all that close. Oh, okay, right. We can come in about that far. See, if I can take out that pylon... That's going to be so hard to do. Alright, just feed the stash... Okay, well, we can just kind of speed up. Speed up the death over here. And so more of the map is belonging to me is always a good thing. Oh. Right, these little beacons of hope are going to turn to Islands of Despair very, very quickly. Uh, you can actually have some creep, and we are getting close to being done. But we are not done yet. God, can we just get enough nearby to that pylon. I guess it doesn't matter a ton. Okay, this is sort of my border that I'm not allowed in. Oh, yeah, we can actually beam up around the eggs and make those pop. Okay, how are we actually getting in this last bit? Do we just keep feeding the stash? Maybe is the answer. Uh, what are my air sacs up to? Come on, buddy. Kind of flying the wrong way. Just, there you go, whenever we can. Like, it gives us a little bump. Okay, give us some creep. And pump it in the stash. Oh, I can beam inside the shield. Okay, well, that, that definitely helps. Okay, we found a place to attack. The end of the island will be mine. Okay, that's kind of about my limit. Uh, we can help the sash out. There you go. There you go, bud. That island looks like it needs a bit of creep. Okay, we can keep flooding up there. Oh, I see that pile I put. Wasn't awful. And let's try and take it from the back. I just want to get a mega wave going on in that corner. They've got so many upgraded mortars, like, they really cut into my my business. We're making progress. We're getting through the wall. Slow and steady wins the race is kind of the catchphrase of this, this map. But just keep filling this in. Yeah, like, look at the size of that wave going in. 
And they are running out of weapons. Uh, I really want to hit those mines. Actually, how many snipers do they even have left? Not a lot. And if we can take out the... The factory, then hopefully we will be able to... Stop their air support working quite as well. Okay, right, yeah, we're, we're, we're in. We got this. I think it's time just to sit back and enjoy the Mega Wave. Kind of stalling a little bit on the shields, but see as the Rift Lab is wholly underwater now. I don't think, I don't think they're going to be doing super well. Uh, these damn snipers shooting my eggs. And they don't have shields. Yeah, God, it's not as if those shields were really going to help them anyway. Blap blammer. And we got it! Nice! Okay, now you don't even have a rift lab to protect you. Eat creep. Just give them so much. Oh my god, there's so much now. Wow. God, like when we started out just picking up the tiniest little amount. Congratulations, my children! This world is free from humans now. Amazing. I love it. What a cool map! Good times. Uh, I hope you guys enjoyed that. Until next time, everybody. See ya.